Hey guys, this is Headlines. It's Monday and the wet colors are fully charged after the weekend and ready to pursue their professional goals. You know that tech companies have been rife with 九九六内卷福报 these years. In English, it is called hustle culture. Hustle culture simply means constant working and career has become top priority in your life. Forbes articles reviews hustle culture may hurt your career. 内卷文化会伤害到你的职业生涯 Let's take a look at the word hustle first. Hustle is a noun, means a rapid, active movement. 有个词组是 hustle and bustle, 熙熙攘攘，忙忙碌碌 Examples: I love living among the hustle and bustle of the city. Let's go on vacation and leave the hustle and bustle of everyday life. In informal American English, hustle could denote fraud. 有一个一三年的美国电影就叫做《American Hustle》，美国骗局 ，starring Jennifer Lawrence and Christian Bale with a viewer rating of six point seven in Dubai. Hustle as a verb is complicated. There are three general usages. Number one, to move or act energetically and rapidly. 匆忙的 example: We hustled to get dinner ready on time. Number two. To make somebody move quickly by pushing and pulling them along, 强行推搡 Um, is the celebrity was hustled out of the hall by bodyguards after the show. Number three, to try to persuade someone, especially to buy something, often illegally, 非法兜售 Example: They made a living by hustling stolen goods on the street. 之前学过一个词叫做 hawk， 沿街售卖，可以放在一起记 If you're not familiar with the hustle culture movement, you may be thinking of the old school definition. But these days, hustling refers to putting work above all else—a never-ending chase for yet another client or promotion. Hustling can derail your career and satisfaction in the long run for several key reasons that you may not have considered. Hustle culture in old school definition is related with pushing sales tactics. 过去那种咄咄逼人的销售技巧 Now hustle culture has other names: burnout culture, workaholism, or toxic productivity. Rail is 轨道 derail is to run off the rails. 脱轨 For example, we will list the things that might derail us on the way to that goal. In the long run, is in the end, eventually. Hustle culture is 把工作放在第一位，无止境的追求新的客户和职位提升。它最终会让你的职业生涯和满足感脱轨。Nearly seven percent of professional workers admit to becoming victims of burnout, according to research. For financial sector employees, burnout rates have clocked in as high as eighty-five percent. Professional worker is employee engaged in intellectual work as opposed to physical work. 可以理解为脑力劳动者或者是 white collar worker 白领 Burnout is exhaustion caused by constantly feeling swamped. 人被熬干了，榨干了 You could also say burnout culture instead of hustle culture. 它也可以当动词用 After a month of twelve-hour work days, most of us burn out and quit. Clock in. 打卡，上班打卡 ，clock in； 下班打卡 ，clock out。Burnout rate， 燃尽率，或者是说员工的被掏空率吧，达到了百分之八十五。这里作者很巧妙的用 clock in 当做动词。我的理解是一方面 clock in and out 代表了工作的时长，另外一方面掏空率像打卡一样，咔嗒一声被记录了下来。If you have any other version of translation on this sentence, feel free to let me know. Okay. Three ways hustle culture may hurt your career. Number one, hustle culture positions your output as your worth. 把你的工作产出看成是你的价值 The subtext is if you can't get output, then you are worthless. It is typical alienation of labor. 这是典型的马克思说的劳动的异化 Number two, hustle culture sets unrealistic expectations. 设置不切实际的期待 Some bosses developed KPIs beyond reach, saying that you have to step out of your comfort zone and do something challenging. You have a lot of potential. You're gonna push yourself to the limit, and blah blah blah. And that's bullshit. Number three, hustle culture spreads your thing. 之前只听说过 spread your wings， 展开翅膀。这里是 spread you thing. It's an idiom. Meaning, try to do too many things at the same time, and you don't have enough time for any of them. 贪多嚼不烂。比如说 ，take it easy, don't spread yourself too thin. 这三点都是特别好而且特别常用的表达，能背的最好背下来。
Frankly speaking, I got trapped in hustle culture several years ago. It was terrifying and exhausting. I hope you guys won't get into this and have a balanced life. This is Atlines. See you in the next episode.